Hi and welcome back to WeConvert. In this video we will talk about the reorder button. This widget is a very powerful widget to encourage your customers to buy again the same exact order that they just purchased. This widget is an especially good fit for stores selling consumable products, but you can probably find a way to use it in your store even if your products are not necessarily consumable. During the tutorial we will mostly be using the page builder of Reconvert. If you're not sure how to get to it or how to use the app, I encourage you to go check out our onboarding video to learn exactly about how the app works. We will place our reorder button here at the right section of the page. So let's go to the right area, add a section and just look for the reorder. Here it is. Now this is a very very simple widget but powerful. So we have a text box and a button. Let's go through the settings and see what we can do with it. Let's start by editing the text. So I created a title and a subtitle and centered them. This is very basic, but you can, again, do whatever you want with the text box. You can add links, change colors, fonts, you know the drill. Now let's move on to the discount. We use an automatic discount in the reorder button. So all you have to do is choose what type of discount you want to offer. It could be a percentage or a fixed amount. I'm going to go with a percentage discount and give 20% off. I suggest that when you create the reorder button, you give a relatively higher discount than you do in other places in your store because you want the customers to feel like this is a special discount for them because they just completed the order. Otherwise, it would just be another discount that they could get in another way and it would not push them to actually complete a second purchase. Lastly, we will edit the button. Let's start with the text on the button and we can edit the placement of the button. I'm going to center it so it looks okay with the rest of the widget and we can edit the colors. I will give it this nice light red color and keep the text as is. Okay, let's save this and see what it actually looks like in a live thank you page. So as you can see in our thank you page, the reorder button is available right here. We didn't need to set up any links or anything else in the button because, and this is the very powerful part of this widget, this button takes us directly to checkout. It does not take the customer to the product page or even to the shipping details page because we have customer information already. We just need the customer to re-enter his payment details and we can complete the purchase. So let's do that right now. So as you can see, we have the discount applied right here and we did not have to go through any of the checkout processes. We already have our shipping details filled in here. We can change them if we want to and we need to choose a payment provider. Now in this test store, we only offer cash on delivery. So this is why that's the only option we have here. In your own store, you will have a place to fill in the credit card information or PayPal information. All we have to do is complete order and we're done. I hope this video was helpful and if you have any more questions, please contact our lovely support team. They will be happy to help. Have a great day and have fun improving your retention rate.